NVIDIA announces Project GR00T Foundation Model for Humanoid Robots and Major Isaac Robotics Platform Update. NVIDIA is building a comprehensive AI platform for leading humanoid robot companies such as 1X Technologies, Agility Robotics, Aptronic, Boston Dynamics, Figure AI, Fourier Intelligence, Sanctuary AI, Unitary Robotics and XPENG Robotics, among others. Isaac Robotics Platform now provides developers new robot training simulator, Jetson Thor Robot Computer, Generative AI Foundation Models, and CUDA Accelerated Perception and Manipulation Libraries. Project GR00T, a general-purpose multimodal foundation model for humanoids, acts as the mind of robots, making them capable of learning skills to solve a variety of tasks. GTC, NVIDIA today announced Project GR00T, a general-purpose foundation model for humanoid robots, designed to further its work driving breakthroughs in robotics and embodied eye. As part of the initiative, the company also unveiled a new computer, Jetson Thor, for humanoid robots based on the NVIDIA Thor system on a chip, as well as significant upgrades to the NVIDIA Isaac robotics platform, including generative AI foundation models and tools for simulation and AI workflow infrastructure. Building foundation models for general humanoid robots is one of the most exciting problems to solve in AI today, said Jensen Huang, founder and CEO of NVIDIA. The enabling technologies are coming together for leading roboticists around the world to take giant leaps towards artificial general robotics. Robots powered by GR00T, which stands for Generalist Robot 00 Technology, will be designed to understand natural language and emulate movements by observing human actions, quickly learning coordination, dexterity and other skills in order to navigate, adapt and interact with the real world. In his GTC keynote, Huang demonstrated several such robots completing a variety of tasks. Jetson Thor was created as a new computing platform capable of performing complex tasks and interacting safely and naturally with people and machines. It has a modular architecture optimized for performance, power and size. The SOC includes a next-generation GPU based on the NVIDIA Blackwell architecture with a transformer engine delivering 800 teraflops of 8-bit floating-point AI performance to run multimodal generative AI models like GR00T. With an integrated functional safety processor, a high-performance CPU cluster and 100 gigabytes of Ethernet bandwidth, it significantly simplifies design and integration efforts. NVIDIA is building a comprehensive AI platform for leading humanoid robot companies such as 1X Technologies, Agility Robotics, Aptronic, Boston Dynamics, Figure AI, Fourier Intelligence, Sanctuary AI, Unitary Robotics and XPENG Robotics, among others. We are at an inflection point in history, with human-centric robots like Digit poised to change labor forever. Modern AI will accelerate development, paving the way for robots like Digit to help people in all aspects of daily life, said Jonathan Hurst, co-founder and chief robot officer at Agility Robotics. We're excited to partner with NVIDIA to invest in the computing, simulation tools, machine learning environments and other necessary infrastructure to enable the dream of robots being a part of daily life. Embodied AI will not only help address some of humanity's biggest challenges, but also create innovations which are currently beyond our reach or imagination, said Jordi Rose, co-founder and CEO of Sanctuary AI. Technology this important shouldn't be built in silos, which is why we prioritize long-term partners like NVIDIA. Major updates to Isaac platform. The Isaac tools that GR00T utilizes are capable of creating new foundation models for any robot embodiment in any environment. Among these tools are Isaac Lab for reinforcement learning and Osmo, a compute orchestration service. Embodied AI models require massive amounts of real and synthetic data. The new Isaac Lab is a GPU-accelerated, lightweight, performance-optimized application built on Isaac Sim specifically for running thousands of parallel simulations for robot learning. To scale robot development workloads across heterogeneous compute, 
Osmo coordinates the data generation, model training and software, hardware in the loop workflows across distributed environments. NVIDIA also announced Isaac Manipulator and Isaac Perceptor, a collection of robotics pre-trained models, libraries and reference hardware. Isaac Manipulator offers state-of-the-art dexterity and modular AI capabilities for robotic arms, with a robust collection of foundation models and GPU-accelerated libraries. It provides up to an ATX speed-up in path planning and zero-shot perception increases efficiency and throughput, enabling developers to automate a greater number of new robotic tasks. Among early ecosystem partners are Yaskawa, Universal Robots, a Teradyne company, Picnic Robotics, Solomon, Ready Robotics and Franca Robotics. Isaac Perceptor provides multi-camera, 3D surround vision capabilities, which are increasingly being used in autonomous mobile robots adopted in manufacturing and fulfillment operations to improve efficiency and worker safety as well as reduce error rates and costs. Early adopters include ArcBest, BYD and Kyan Group as they aim to achieve new levels of autonomy in material handling operations and more. The presentation featuring the BDX robots from Disney added an extra layer of excitement and novelty to the event. Here are some details about their inclusion. The presenter introduced the BDX robots from Disney as special guests during the event. This introduction may have included their significance, such as their role in showcasing the latest advancements in robotics or the unique features that set them apart. During their appearance, the BDX robots showcased their capabilities to the audience. This could include various actions, interactions, or performances designed to highlight their advanced programming and technical capabilities. It's that the presentation highlighted the technology powering the BDX robots, such as Jetson Robotics computers. These advanced computing systems provide the processing power and intelligence necessary for the robots to perform complex tasks and interact with humans seamlessly. Given their affiliation with Disney, the presentation might have mentioned the collaboration between Disney Research and other entities involved in developing and programming the BDX robots. This collaboration underscores Disney's commitment to innovation and technology in entertainment. The mention of the BDX robots as special guests likely emphasized their role in advancing both entertainment and robotics industries. These robots represent the cutting edge of technology and showcase the potential for integrating robotics into various aspects of entertainment, including theme parks, movies, and live performances. The BDX robots might have engaged directly with the audience during their presentation, this could involve interactions such as answering questions, responding to commands, or even performing small tasks or demonstrations based on audience input. The inclusion of the BDX robots from Disney as special guests added an element of excitement, innovation, and technological prowess to the presentation. Their demonstration likely captivated the audience and provided a glimpse into the future of robotics and entertainment. These are the five things that we talked about today. What does NVIDIA look like? When we talk about GPUs, there's a very different image that I have. When people ask me about GPUs, first I see a bunch of software stacks and things like that. And second, I see this. This is what we announced to you today. This is Blackwell. This is the Plat Amazing Amazing Processes, NV Link Switches, Networking Systems. And the system design is a miracle. This is Blackwell. And this to me is what a GPU looks like in my mind. Listen, orange, green. I think we have one more treat for everybody. What do you think? Should we? Okay, we have one more thing to show you. Roll it. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great GTC. Thank you all for coming. Thank you.